your site for your passion project. The first thing that you're going to do is you're going to go to sites.google.com. Click on there and it'll bring you up to the Google Sites website. What you want to do then is you want to click over here where it says template gallery and it'll probably default you to general but you just want to click over where it says center city public charter schools and you're going to click on this template that says passion project. So you click on it and that will open up your own Google site put in your own Google Drive. You can see that in the middle it's just a really basic template. It says passion project, it says student name underscore passion project. You're going to change where it says student name and you're going to put your own name. So I would put Samantha Novak and then leave it where it says passion project and then up here you're going to do the same thing. So it says Samantha Novak. And so now my site is renamed. Okay, then we're going to click over. So you can do whatever you want to this front page. Um, you can change the image that's in the background. Um, maybe it's something that has to do with your passion project. Maybe it's a picture of you. Um, you can put whatever you want there. You can also edit your text and put whatever kind of text you like um, here as well. So that's your option for there. Once you're done kind of designing your home page, um, you're going to click to quarter one. On quarter one, you'll see that there are all of the weeks already set up for you. And so this is where you're going to do your reflections every single week. If your project is creating a Google site, then this can be your Google site. Um, you may want to add a different page. Uh, that would actually be your project and then another page for your reflections. We can talk a little bit more about that in the future. For right now, what you want to do is every single week, you're going to either need to upload a picture or upload a video um, that goes along with your reflection. So for week three, um, let's say I spent time practicing um, drumming the guitar today to the melody of um, Little Drummer Boy. Okay. Um, it was hard because I had never done it before, but it was exciting. Uh, to practice something new. Okay, so I have that. And now I'm going to add either a video or a picture here. So when you click on the plus sign, you can click all these different options. If um, your video, if you have a video, you want to click from drive and that's where you'll have to put your videos. And then you can just scroll down and find it in your drive. Um, so I'm going to give an example of an old Wii video that we have. And so I would just click here and I would click insert. So now my video would be right here. The last thing that you're going to want to do is you're want to, going to want to click publish. And so it should say your name. So mine says Samantha Novak passion project, and that will be my site. And so I'll click publish and that should publish the site. If you want to preview what your site looks like, you click here and this will show you what your site looks like um, when somebody's visiting it. You can look at it from a computer perspective, a tablet perspective, or an iPhone perspective. Um, you X out of that to go back to your main page. Also feel free to change your fonts. Uh, you can change over here, there's different themes. So maybe you wanna change your theme. That will change your pictures and your fonts and your colors. Um, and so you can choose to make your site look however you want. Um, but just know that you need to keep these week three, week four, week five all there. And those are the things that you're updating every single day.